Hello and welcome, in this video I remade Super Mario Bros in Unreal Engine 4. I decided that I'd recreate the very first level of the game. First I created a new project in Unreal Engine using the first person template as I wanted to create this game from the perspective of first person. I had to remove the gun as I didn't want Mario to be carrying around a gun in this game. I then got to work on making my characters jump. In Mario, when you hold down the jump button, you jump further and if you tap it, you jump shorter. So first I set this up. And now when my character held down the jump button, he would jump much higher and if he just tapped it, he would jump for a short amount of time. Next, I wanted to set up some enemies for the game. I didn't want to model these from scratch, so I headed to Sketchfab where I found some models of them and I downloaded them. I first started with the Goomba, although I didn't have any animations, so I headed over to Blender and I rigged the Goomba and created some animations for it. In the end, I was able to make a nice walking cycle for the Goomba. Now that we had a simple animation for the Goomba, I imported him into Unreal Engine and set up his logic. So now he can detect if something's in front of him and if there's something in front of him, he'll turn around and walk in the opposite direction. I also set it up so that my player can jump on the Goomba and kill him and it also gives the player a small boost when he jumps and kills the Goomba. Next, I got to work on setting up the Koopa. This was a bit easier because his structure kind of resembles a humanoid pose so I was able to rig him with Mixamo and easily set him up with some animations. I then put him in Unreal and set it up so that when you jump in on the Koopa, he goes into his shell and then this shell can also be flung at Goombas and this will launch them and kill them. Now that I had all my enemies set up, I got to work on setting up some power-ups from Mario. So in the game, there are two power-ups. There's the mushroom, which will make him bigger and it'll also allow him to destroy blocks. And then there's the fire flower. So when he gets this, he can shoot fireballs and instantly kill enemies. So for the mushroom, I didn't really do much. I just made it so when he gets the mushroom, it'll make his camera higher and it'll make Mario look like he is taller. And then with the fire flower, I set it up so that when my player gets the fire flower, he can then shoot fireballs. So I made these projectile fireballs and when they hit players, they just launch the enemies away. I then set up two types of blocks, question blocks and normal blocks. So question blocks would contain a power up, either a mushroom or a fire flower. and then normal blocks. So if my player was in his small form and he tried to hit a normal block, nothing would happen. But if he had a mushroom power up and he hit a normal block, it would be smashed to pieces like it happens in the original game. With this, I had most of the things set up that I would need to make the first level of the game. So I then started to design the first level of the game. I recently got this new monitor, which allowed me to easily um, switch screens and design the level quite fast. I then polished up the game, adding a flagpole. So when my player jumps on the flagpole, the flagpole goes down with him. And I also set up a HUD, which will show the amount of time he has left in the level and some other things. With all of this, I had recreated the first level of Super Mario Bros. in Unreal Engine 4. So here's some gameplay of it.
at all. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.